may have seen semicolon, speaking of bodies and body art, <laughs> you may have seen semicolon tattoos popping up in your Facebook feed, even on people, perhaps. The Now's Rachel Lado spoke with a local woman who joined in on this trend. It is a trend, I guess. It is a trend. It's gaining traction on social media. It's called Project Semicolon, and the goal of Project Semicolon is to bring awareness to mental health oh, issues. Fantastic. So Erin Herbert from Jupiter got her semicolon tattoo about a month ago. She says the idea stuck out to her since it covers so many aspects of mental health awareness, depression, anxiety, suicide, self-harm, and the loss of a loved one. All things Erin says she's experienced through people close to her. Now the project explains that a semicolon is used when an author could have chosen to end their sentence but chose not to and says people like Erin are the authors of their lives and the sentence she is writing is her own life. It reminds me that to keep going, you know, start to focus on myself and keep becoming a better person for my children and now, according to Project's uh, website, in, the, in addition to bringing it attention to mental health issues, the project exists to encourage, love, and inspire. So the next time you see a semicolon up on your Facebook feed or, of course, on a person, now you know the story behind it. Thank you for bringing us that. Rachel, thank you.